What is going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Nicola Espresso and welcome back to another Black Ops 3 video here today on the channel. This one probably going to be a little shorter of one because there's not as much stuff to go over here as with other videos recently, but this one is going to be probably the final video talking about all the futures of supply drops and their contents here within Black Ops 3. It's no surprise that there is still a lot of content on the horizon. We're only about halfway through the year within Black Ops 3, so with that being said, all the microtransaction DLC that we've seen so far, pretty much add that in again and you can see what will be getting the rest of the year as well. So with that being said, is there anything that is necessarily brand new to this that we'll be seeing in supply drops? Is there something besides weapons, camos, as well as specialist themes that we can see come here out of this? That simple answer quite could possibly be yes. Once again, and finally referring back to this Reddit post that we've been talking about the past couple of days here, well, this actually will then add into a few other things here. Well, we know we've seen the smaller items out of supply drops being camos, calling cards, as well as emblem textures, but what else could there be? Well, there are actually two very interesting ones that are brought up into question here within this Reddit thread. Those being HUD skins as well as announcer packs. Now, firstly, HUD skins, if you guys don't know what the HUD is, the heads up display is everything that you see on your playable screen, such as the mini map, the ammo counter, your weapon choice, your score streaks, all that that is overlaid on top of the actual gameplay. Anything that isn't there whenever you play hardcore is your heads up display. So this idea is that heads up display skins or rather themes, like we kind of mentioned, it's not necessarily a skin in the sense of a camo. Obviously, you can't have that on a heads up display but this would be something where it would change the look of this ever so slightly the first thing that comes to my mind is almost how like the predator vision in the 1980s movies is completely different than what the human eye sees so kind of like that it's a weird little similarity I know but where there would be some alteration to it so that the theme would be different I'm not quite sure how that would work out entirely but it would be something very cool and something a little bit more innovative here that we could see in Call of Duty in terms of customization and micro DLC another Another big thing here, like we mentioned, was the announcer packs. These did absolutely tremendously well in Call of Duty Ghosts. It might not be the best-selling microtransaction DLC, but it was something that was, at the time, very innovative and very cool, and a lot of people I know bought them. So it's something that we could see that being tossed into supply drops as well. We don't know who, obviously, it would be because, well, there's a lot of voices to choose from here out in this world, and maybe, you know, I could make my way into Black Ops 3, but all joking aside, I think it would be a very cool addition here as well, and because it probably would be in that mid-level of demand, I think it might fit well in supply drops where it's not something that absolutely everybody wants and if they don't get it, they uproar over it. And it's not something that also will limit people from trying to buy supply drops to get them. So it's a nice little common ground, I think, but that's what we're gonna wrap this video up here today, ladies and gentlemen. That is on the supposed horizon here from this leaker on Reddit talking about all the future of microtransaction DLCs and supply drops in the Black Ops 3. I think it's very cool. I wanted to bring it to you guys and let you guys know about it a little bit here, but that's what we're gonna wrap it up. Thank you guys so much for watching. Leave your thoughts down there in the comment section down below. Would you like to see the announcer packs come back or do you not necessarily care too much about them? Love to hear your thoughts, but thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys did like this video, be sure to like rating down below. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. We're on that road to 30,000 subscribers, so every little bit does help and is, as always, greatly appreciated. But, my name is Nicole. I'll see you guys later. Take care and peace.